San Francisco's District Attorney Chase Boudin is out. That and more election results coming up on this special edition of Synced In. Hey everyone, it's the day after the primary election and we have some results. San Franciscans have voted to remove DA Chase Abudin from office. Here's what he had to say on election night after the result came in. We are just getting started because we knew that fixing a system that has systematically failed us, not just for decades, but for generations, for centuries, was not the work of one year or one term. It's certainly not the work of one man or woman or one office. It is work that requires a sustained social movement. Mayor London Breed will be in charge of choosing his replacement. All right, a race we were closely watching on Tuesday. Who's up for San Jose's new mayor? So, California is one of two U.S. states that has a top two primary election format. That means the top two candidates with the highest votes in the primary move on to the general election. Votes are still being counted, but Santa Clara County Supervisor Cindy Chavez and San Jose City Councilman Matt Mahan appear to be the two who will face off in November. They each spoke after the early results came in. Take a listen. We're going to watch returns for tonight and maybe for days, actually. Um, but here's what I want you to know. I'm ready. I'm ready to take this campaign to the next level. Are you ready? <laughs> I'm ready to get into more neighborhoods and do more house parties and walk more precincts and make more phone calls and raise more money. We, it's going to be awesome. We're going to do this together. I'm, I'm absolutely excited about it. I'm going to give you the rest of the night off. <laughs> because we begin again tomorrow morning. I feel great. We, we started off back in September, tied for last place with about 5% support. We've come a long way. I'm feeling like we're making great progress. I think voters want to see accountability for results. I, I think we've been doing a lot of the same things and expecting different outcomes. And, and, and it's just time to take a different direction on crime, homelessness, affordable housing. I mean, voters want a choice and they're going to have one in November because I, I've got fresh ideas and my opponent's been around for 30 years. The focus on accountability. We need to be actually looking at the data and when our policies aren't producing the outcomes our community needs, we need to admit it and, and, and pursue different strategies. You can read more about both of the mayoral candidates on our website. Okay, well, the other South Bay election we're following is the Santa Clara County Sheriff's race. The same top two rule applies here as well. And the two currently ahead right now are Robert Johnson and Kevin Jensen. Here's our digital video journalist Jonathan Bloom with more on the candidates. Kevin Jensen wants to improve transparency and boost morale at an agency that's accused of misconduct and cover-ups. He wants to build a new jail and fix a culture of fear and intimidation among inmates. Robert Johnson would appoint a community advisory board and an internal task force to make it a better place to work. He likes the governor's plan for care courts, doling out mental health care instead of jail time. We are updating the results as the votes come in. You can find that, plus a lot more election coverage, right now on NBCBayArea.com slash Decision 2022. All right, that's it for the special edition of Synced In. Thanks for watching. Bye.